what it's that uh, oh look at who's that guy and that's his son over there hey. music therapy live here with Zane Dane of Zim's guitars why do I say Zane I always say Zane that's okay man I get that a lot my high school yearbook said Dave Dave no I said Zane yeah, I know I get that a lot He's so tall, it's like looking up at a giant, like you're like this, anyway. What's up, dude? So we're here at NAMM, day three. We're trying to get a lot of stuff done, but check this out. This is really cool. This is that new modeler. I I'm gonna go check out Rob Chapman guitars. They're that way. Oh, dude, I totally want to check let's out. Let's go Chapman. check out Chapman. Let's go to Chapman. Yeah, let's go. You said you were gonna meet up with him, right? <laughs> you told him, hey, I'll meet up with you, sure. He's expecting you. I did say that. We lost Martin. Martin is gone. I don't know. He wanted to get more done, and we were slowing him down, so he had to get going. You know, he had a lot of stuff he wanted to see and a lot of things he wanted to do. So he just ditched us. Oh, yeah. Zero people watching right now. Zero. Zero people watching. Where's Chapman? Keep going and it's gonna be at that end to the left. He might already left. I don't know. It's supposed to be like there on the left side somewhere. Michael B. that uh, from Michael B. say hi to the Monkey Lord. Okay, right, right. Um, 
Mike will be went out there that way, so Mike will be back. He'll be back, I'm sure. But it's great to meet you. See you. I, I got a chance to meet Dan and Mick on my first show in 2019. I ran into him at the JHS booth early in the morning on the Saturday. That was great. Yeah, yeah. Very good guys. Good guys. Uh, and it's great to see you with Lee. It's great Thank to see you very much. Captain Lee. Captain Lee. He's not here, though. No, I know, yeah. He's out on the ship. Yeah, he's out on the ship. Sailing. Well, he looked like he just got off that ship. He got such a nice tan. Oh, is, Look at this guy. Looks like he was with Henning out on the island. It is you. Yeah, no, yeah. I, I wasn't. I wasn't. Yeah. Hey, but great to Were you just you. saying Michael B? Yeah, I mentioned Michael B. I just got a Michael B in here saying that he loves you. Oh, right, okay. Yeah. Michael well, B. Hey, Michael B. Everybody loves me. Michael on. B, get a shout out. Yeah, Michael B. Love you too, man. Wow. <laughs> Can I get you to say, watch Music Therapy Last on YouTube? Watch me. Yeah, I saw when uh, Chapman handed over an ML3 to Aaron Alvin's band, you know. Oh, right, right, yeah, yeah. He gave him one. Uh, yeah. And I got to play it at uh, JJ's. Uh, another buddy of ours has got a really great new grunge band called Star Zero. Yeah. If you like that kind of music, they're, they're killing it right now. Exactly. He's a great singer. Uh, actually, it's because of that guy Johnny Bean that that guy got back into playing guitar and joining a band. So that's what kind of got me all into this crazy stuff. I used to have one guitar and one amp. Now you don't even want to know. <laughs> a couple of years ago, I actually brought a yo-yo with me to Nam. Yeah, I remember that. That was the year I first got yeah. yeah. I've got good yo-yo tricks. But I got Michael Anthony, the, the pedal boy, the, uh, the pedal show. Those yeah, yeah, guys, yeah, yeah. They were great with the YouTube. Dan and Mick. Jeff Keith, or the yo-yo. Uh, Jeff Keith was really good right. with the yo-yo. <laughs> Um, I know a trick Steve or two. There, he's like, bro, I'm not rehearsed for this. I know you don't need to rehearse. Uh, Michael Anthony did a yo-yo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Michael uh, Anthony. Uh, Glenn uh, Bricker did a yo-yo. No, he's like, I'm doing a damn yo-yo trick. Smash him. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, so yeah, it was fun. Of course, he would smash the yo-yo, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. what Michael Anthony did one with all the CNN cameras, all these flash pods were going on. Uh, yeah, that's a lot, a lot of fun. There's a fun yo-yo. Jared Dimes did a yo-yo trick. Bob did a yo-yo trick. But this was pretty common now when everybody was here. Yeah, yeah. You could touch was, things, right? Yeah, We're almost getting, back to that. I mean, almost. I'm yeah. just close to getting Peter Frampton. Wow. He was up in the uh, up in uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. there somewhere. Well, that would have been nice. Let me ask you, Pete, what have you seen so far that you really love here? Outside of the shop, but the guitars, everything. Something that's really cool? Yeah. What you, what I, I love the new T-Rex Vincent Echo Rex. I love that one, I've too. I went one. by that. Yeah, I actually messed uh, around with it, and I even touched the, the thing. That's you know? very, very cool. Yeah. I mean, that's a lot of cool stuff. That's a very cool thing. It's a lot of cool yeah. stuff. Yeah. Uh, I like, I'm looking forward to trying the, um, the LR bags. They got a new Hi-Fi um, Microphone to put in Microphone for acoustics. Yeah, acoustic yeah. guitars. Yeah. Um, yeah. Looking forward to trying to plug that in. Very and, cool. But, you know, lots of good stuff. Yeah, lots of good and stuff. And I've got my signature guitar as well. You know, that's Show us I, your signature guitar. It's the yellow one, not the purple one, but it's the yellow one. Right okay, the right mustard the yellow. I used to have a Volvo, that color. I love but that that's color. Because this color is a 1970s Porsche color. Perfect. Which Volvo also used. It's called Bahama Yellow. I and called I like it. Old cars, so. It was my surf mobile. We used to throw surfboards in the back of it while I was in college. And we'd go surfing, and yeah. and it was full of sand and smelled terrible. But we love. It lasted for about a year, and it was a great experience for. Us. Yeah, but that's my. That's the color of my old car. Yeah, that's great. Awesome. So what? What? What about it? Do you love? Why is it like your thing? So well, it's so it's we we scanned the neck of my purple Telecaster because it's had a it's got a special neck cuff that Fender couldn't even talk, tell us what was. Wow. So we ended up scanning it. And um, the pickups in there, Monty's pickups, I've got a couple of calves in it. My daughter designed the scratch blade on oh, it. Oh, we got to check that out. Um, oh yeah, very cool, look at that. It's not just a shiny scratch blade with dust on it. Exactly, and then we got a, we got a calf here. Yeah. Ah, look, it's got a little bit of crackle. I remember when you did that crackle guitar that one time yeah. with Andertons, you know, that was great. Look at that. Oh yeah. So we got nice. a cool, cool belly calf yeah, there. Belly car, nice car like up there. Nice little car there. Nice neck. Look at that. Yeah. So I will, do you I like? Do you like the glossy necks versus the satin? I mean, this, this is way uh, kind of. It's half and half. This. Okay, I've I taken some of it off. Yeah. yeah. So it's uh, it's a nitro neck on here. Very nice. Which will yeah. be 
and this is the prototype, so. Very nice. Um, but yeah. Nitro on that. Yeah. Nitro. Yeah, yeah, it is, yeah. So that'll be. Beautiful. And when are these going to come out? Well, hopefully this year. Maybe awesome. This year, yeah. So these are ready to go. There's a custom shop made version oh. in the UK. And Very then there'll nice. Be, there'll be a, um, a version made in, in, uh, in India, which is going to be less than a grand. Nice. Same, uh, same India. pickups as your purple one. Yeah, same pickups in that one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Excellent. I'm interested to see what happens. What, what happens, you know. Oh, I like the P90 there. Yeah. It's good, isn't it? Yeah, very, very. very exciting. Wow. It's very exciting. I like that. It's a TRS. And I like you went with like that almost that GNL style kind of single, you know, pick yeah. up there in the uh, neck with the bigger poles. Yeah, no, this is yeah. an open. Open, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I John Mayer with the US. Very, very cool. Beautiful, I love this. Look at that. Wow. Wow. Look at that. Look at that cold top. Like this guy was mentioning, it, it's made to look like it's older. It's got that, turns greenish as it ages, right? We've got the Infinity Chapman 12 track marker there with Lumen Lays, Lumen Lays, first sighting of Lumen Lays, finally, somebody with Lumen Lays. Reverse headstock, I love that single, single humbucker telly with the switch there. You've got the volume knob in a good far away position, love that. Yeah, I remember when Chapman first started their guitars, you guys. Hey, Quentin, what's up? Danish Pete does rule. Hey, what's up, Johnny? Hey, um, when he first started out this guitar brand, the idea was to have the community of people in Are YouTube. you live? Yeah. It says one. I know 11. <laughs> but yeah, not as many people as you, Johnny. You probably have a 1,000. I have 78. 78? Oh, my God. Yeah, because I turned it off when I went to the bathroom and everyone left. <laughs> and then when I was Thank in goodness. the back, when I was in the back... It was like the worst reception, but I'm it's way better. Jumped. You guys, make sure to check hey, out. Hey, where music where are you guys from? Yeah, check me out. Go do a refresh. Music therapy Laz. Do a refresh. Check jump into Laz's channel jump here. Jump back and forth. Yeah, jump back and forth. Give me a give me a give me a view. That's all I need is views. <laughs> jump in. <laughs> Pete knows. Orange. Yeah, check this guitar out. Dude. Look at this thing. It's killer. Look at that thing. I love this one, man. This is nice. Damn, I like that. Lumen Lays on the edge, Johnny. All right, I think we're going to be done with it. It was nice meeting Pete for the first time live. He's such a cool guy. He's, he's I've like... Had, I've had a lot of breath in my face the past couple of days. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm staying away from you, Johnny. I'm staying away from you. Yeah. Steve Rosen's Steve awesome. Rosen's breath. I'll take... I'll take the anthrax and see Rosen. All right, so I don't know how we can get into Martin. Oh, there's the doorway to Martin. Let's go check out Martin. Let's check out Martin. That's all right. We can. I got the only, the only, the only Chapman pick they had out. I grabbed it. At the table. Martin and Co. Here we are, Martin and Co. Right on Alex Radford, G. Butch Knopf, l &M Guitar Corner. Danish Beat was here indeed. Yeah, he rules, man. Look at that little mini guitar. The Sean Menendez, or Mendez, Jr. Poor little people. Like Johnny. No, I'm dead. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> All right, so some of these have been sold, sold, sold. Sold, sold, sold. There he is. Oh! <laughs> found Martin. Dude, I met up with Danish Pete. I was Pete. saying maybe we'll find Martin at Martin. <laughs> I met Danish Pete and talked with him. Yeah, it was I awesome. I didn't yeah. talk with him because he had lunch right there, so I oh. just wanted to leave him alone. That's nice so of you. Just, uh, yeah. Common courtesy in Pennsylvania. Touch the wood. You can touch the wood. Yeah. Martin at Martin. Everything. I so, went through everything over here. I found people. Do they got, do they got giveaways through. here? What's yeah. that? Yeah. Giveaways. Can you hold this for me for a second? I gotta put sure. this in my backpack, and I'm gonna grab a couple of giveaway things. They've got, they've got giveaways.
give away lanyards and they have give away. Martha, come here. Can you stand in front of them? Can I get you in front of them? Yeah, sure. <laughs> you guys screen cap this. You got to use this for your like photo. There we go. Were you born I, in 1833? No, not not need, not even close. 1986. 86. <laughs> I got yeah. two of these. I got one for myself. I was and born in 87. Yeah. Sure he was. <laughs> <laughs> the better the better picture is the one I over there with the nice with the wall on that you've got. Let me got go there. Let me look at the Martins, you guys. I'm gonna check out the Martins. So yeah, Dane was here. I don't know where he went. Dane, we're, I'm at Martin and Johnny and them walked off somewhere, but. That's very amusing. Check that thing out. So here we got the mini guitars. Some of these you can use this as like a traveler. It's so small. It's nice. It's five, 500 bucks, 499, right? Oh, this is a lefty, look. Another lefty. The x brace series, the 749. All satin finish, so you save on the finish, the satin. All right? So you don't have to spend money on, on you know, the, the gloss and also it's cheaper. 14 frets, right? Here you got the, the Triple O cutaway 14 fret performance artist series, high performing taper. And you got your uh, strap right there, strap button. That's what I was trying to say. The Street Master. Sounds real nice. Let's continue along here. Look at that. Look at the detail on this. Gorgeous. Hey, Alex Rapper, what's up, man? Yeah, I did check out Bola. I have video for you guys. I'm gonna upload all the video. My phone is full of data of videos. That's why I'm doing live stream right now, which is not the best because it cuts in and out of stream. Sometimes the further back you go in this building, you know, pardon me. Check that thing out. Cutaway for better access. If you hold oh, okay, yeah, for a see. second, so if you want better access, it's, it's really. I was wondering why is there like a hole there though, like this little plug thing. So yeah, it's easier, it's right? Totally easy. I like that they put the, the strap lock right there. The high E string. The yeah, the high e, the high E string oh, over here okay. is easily reachable with the pinky if you. Look at that, nice handshake wrap around as Phil McKnight would say. If this was would have been a little bit more rounded over here, it would be even more comfortable. Alex Radford, I think their booth was about the same size. Maybe actually roughly the same as last year. Not that big, but they had some cool guitars for sure. No, I have not seen Sean Tubbs. I didn't know that he was here. I saw a bunch of people though. Just saw Danish Pete had a combo conversation with him, which is cool. He's got a new signature uh, custom chopping guitar coming out, real nice. Hey, Jonathan McCulloch, what's up? Oh, you were asking about the Sean Tubbs question. Let's see, is there any other questions? Do you have any other questions? Throw 
questions at me, you guys. Um, hey, G. Bushnop, I'm here at. Is there anything here at Martin you guys want to see? I need to make a short of this one because the inlays. Are yeah, the, the inlays are gorgeous. Look at that. Some of the inlay work up at uh, EMG it was amazing. I shot some earlier video for that. Beautiful kind of like a honey burst. Look at that ebony on the top there. It's a koa with fishmen. Electronics in there, right? $15.99. $19.99. I played some of these ones before. These are really something else. Feels really good. You got your controls right inside here. Rather than on the body, it's right here in the bracing. Right? You will also have, want to have a look. Over there is the Bitcoin guitar. That one is sold. But the Bitcoin you guitar. Have, you will have to look at the inlays over there. For all the special. Shipping actually. Over there is the Nam guitar. I don't know where my man is. The Nam guitar, yeah, I remember seeing that one, yeah. We're gonna check that out. All kinds of cool parts. And the Nam guitar with real diamonds. Serial number 2,501 because that's how much it costs. The meta taste. <laughs> I knew it was a good brand. Diamonds on the guitar, look at that. Look at that. Locked in the case right here. Diamonds. Diamond studded guitar. Beautiful rosewood. Or is that, no, that looks like walnut. Walnut back in size, rosewood neck. The backpacker. It's not much sound come out of those things. Not a huge fan of those. dollar guitar right here. This is the GPC. Hey, Michael B, what's up? Yeah, that was nice seeing uh, Danish Pete, right? Check these things out. This one's only $12,000. See, Amanda Peters can paint beautiful paintings like this on your guitars. Look at that. I'm sure she's she's got the same kind of skills. She could pull this off. Look at that. Johnny wants to move on. Alright, where? Where are we going to go now? We promised that we would check out um, 
the um, H90 over at the um, Eventide booth. Let's go check out the Eventide booth. Okay. Yeah. I don't know where Johnny is, but why don't we go through the back or is he out there? Over there. We're out front, so we'll go grab. And I, I grab, let's grab a lanyard here. I remember one. You guys have any picks? You guys have any picks? Gave away all the picks. Okay, yeah, I, I was gonna get some to give away myself, so yeah, viewers of the show. That's all right. We'll grab one extra lanyard for a viewer then, if that's okay. I'll grab one more lanyard, Martin yeah, lanyard. Yeah, no. So we have a yeah, grab one. Uh, grab, yeah. grab your own. Yeah. We get more for uh, viewers, right? We want to give these things away to you guys. Not everyone gets to go to NAM, so. Johnny, we're gonna go to uh, Eventide and see if we can mess around with the Eventide H90 a little. We've been to Rev like five times. Let's yeah. go to Eventide and check out the Eventide H90. Let's go. Let's go. Seriously, we've been to Rev several times. Yeah, we have. We just rewind. Go to yesterday's stream. We actually uh, go to. The you gotta. Day before that. Hey, uh, you gotta get uh, Janice, the intern, to like bookmark or whatever they call that timestamp. Actually, that's something that Adam Roach has been doing. Oh, Adam Roach, he's you rock. Adam, Adam, you're he's amazing. Been, he's been time my videos. I wish I had Thank you so much, Adam an intern Roach. like Adam Roach. Thank you, Adam Roach. Adam Roach. Man, I can smell some coffee, some good coffee. Let's get some coffee. I know. Let's go back to that coffee. That's, that's somewhere. Well, that's by the drum area. I don't want to go there again, but okay. Why don't we get coffee after? Because we're we've got how much time left? Not many. Because I'm, I'm going to get a phone call. Yeah, you're going to have to leave. Call, I have to leave. Johnny's got a secret not appointment. He's not going, telling I'm, anyone. I'm going to dinner. It's pretty heavy. Pretty heavy. Yeah. I wish I could go, but I understand. <laughs> There's the Rickenbacker. Let's show Rickenbacker. We haven't showed Rickenbacker yet. Let's show you guys the Rickenbacker. Don't worry, Janice. Um, I think he's got somebody on that time stamping thing, but. No, don't rewind. Don't worry, Janice. Johnny was just joking around. Don't listen to Johnny. Hey, who's that guy? I recognize that guy. Ricky, Ricky guitars. Look at that. That's beautiful. I love that. I have always loved that color. The Rickenbacker sunburst. Goes from a goes from a cherry red to like a peach. I've always wondered why they did such a gloss finish on their on their necks, on their fretboards. It makes it so sticky, but that's what they do. I think these are all the same guitars. Okay, no, these ones have like pointy tops. They got so they're, pointy tops. They're pointy, those ones are more rounded. And then here you have your classics. This small one here is kind of cool. I'd like to have one of these small ones, like a triple humbucker thing. They're locked down, so you can't lift them out and play them. That's the more large body, semi-hollow, right? Classic F-hole style. Beautiful. I'd love to have one of these. This black and white one's awesome. And then the bases. Yeah, the action is super low, right? 12 strings. 
Who's that guy? I got 98 people. I got 17 people. Hey, some of the people at Johnny's come to my show and then yeah. go back. Music come here and go back. Check out his channel or open a second browser on your open computer up, and yeah, open up join browser, me, man. man. Oh, look at that. I, I love that checkerboard kind of Check out the delay. Gunner Man, what's up? Yeah, pointy guitars. I, I like this one. Right on, Matthew Stewart. 12 string. The action on the 12 string, too, is like super low. It's awesome. And this is super killer. This is look at that thing. It's gorgeous, gorgeous oh, guitar. Yeah. Did you see everything you wanted to see so far? Uh, I'm written back here, but I've noticed there is Godo. Godo. Oh, Godan. They are here. So last time they were up by the. Uh, yeah. We got Godan up there. He was catching the Godan. We haven't seen high watt yet either. High watts here, you know. Check that little mini mini guitar right there. That's pretty cool. For a little mini travel kind of parlor guitar right there. I love that finish on there. Look at that five string bass. Look, I can't find what you want me to timestamp. No, don't worry, Janice. Don't worry about the timestamping. Johnny and I are okay with that. Don't worry. Janice, you don't, get you don't back have to work. To get back to work, says <laughs> Johnny. No. Don't worry about it. He's messing around. I think you were saying that somebody else already timestamped stuff for you. So, Adam Roach. They're telling, Adam me, they're Roach. telling me your video is frozen. My video is frozen. Me yours is frozen. It's not showing that it's frozen right now. And they said hi, Watts, so they, they must be seeing it. Center Hill Cards, what's up? Yeah, right on. Thank you for double streaming, man. Center Hill Guitars. Thank you very much for double streaming. My cousin had one of their uh, acoustic electrics and swears by the Godan.
we're goofing around now, day three. Yeah. We should keep going though. Yeah, let's keep going. So like let's go really check out, let's go check out that uh, Eventide. We're gonna go check out the Eventide. Mega Todd, what's up? Very low action, right? Mega Todd, I'm sorry you got no action in high school, but you know, you, now's your chance. You're a grown man, go out and get you some. <laughs> shot video of Music Man, so look for that in the future. I'll be posting that stuff up. I did some very nice video where I go slow over everything so you guys can really take a look at everything, right? All right, now, I don't know exactly where Eventide is, so if someone can look it up, do, can you look it up? I don't think we're far. Yeah, but here's High Watt. Check out High Watt amps. I was here earlier. Check these out. 200 watt high watt amp. Look at that. My battery's starting to go low because my screen just went darker. Look. Oh. I'm at 15% now. That's what that means. We're getting close to the uh, close to the percussion area. Yeah, Trey, look at this Ricky bass. So the studio stage, basically, it's like a step up from the house to 20. It should be somewhere in this direction. All right, let's go. I'm going to check out Eventide. Are you sure about that? at the map so he's he's not looking at the map he doesn't because you can you can actually put before and after like start here go there directions yeah but I think he is going the right direction now because we're heading toward the pedals which is where you want to be going warrior guitars Oh, Music Nomad. Hey, you guys, check this out. I've got a lot of these products here. I got that. I got that. I got all those. I got that. I got that. I, got those. I love Music Nomad. Music Nomad's awesome. I got all your stuff, man. I got awesome, man. Get out. I got that. I got that. I got those. I love 
up these. I don't have all this stuff though. I don't think I need this yet. Yeah, get some of that. Like two and string heights in your action and everything, but then when you play, you're like, shit, I don't like it. Every string change. All right, let's get out of here. Oh yeah, look at the humidifiers. Oh, I even got one of these. Acoustic, acoustic strap lock for your acoustic. All right, let's find this. Even tide, right over there. We got even tide coming up. This is where. Uh, oh, look at that! It's Rabe Massad right there. Yeah. Made in Ukraine? Because they got the Ukraine flag on the top there. See? Did we come by here? Yeah, if we didn't come by here, we should have. So, Maybach. Look at that. Hand painted guitars. That one's been sold. These are excellent.